What's up, good people? This is Anthony Deloach, and I'm back with another crypto investing review and tutorial. And today, guys, I got some news for you, right? We're going to be talking about Vortic United. I don't know if you guys have already seen the news, but I wanted to go ahead and make sure I put it out there so that you guys will know what's going on. Now, before I jump right into it, I do want you to go ahead and like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time that I drop a new crypto investing review or tutorial now you guys know what i want you to do make sure you get in my game plan to 100 grand group that's where i share all the latest information first and i want you to make sure that you're in the know on everything that's going on with any platform that i know about or any platform that i'm participating in if you want that type of information look at in the description of this video the link will be there so you can join that group all right guys let's go ahead and get right into it Vortic united man it's been a minute right it's been a minute since we've been able to withdraw from this first it was the working on the withdrawal system then there became another issue another fiasco now let me try to recap a little bit for you so first you know right after the las vegas event there was a withdrawal issue right um the withdrawal system was being updated so they could do instantaneous withdrawals that was taking a while and we were given the the date of august not august i'm sorry i keep saying that october the first October the 1st came, they were still working on it um, because there was another issue, another bug that was going on, which it was with the 30 day plans were putting millions of dollars into people's back offices. And then when they went in and they tried to reinvest that money or anything because they couldn't withdraw. So they tried to reinvest that money. It put millions of dollars of commissions into back, the back office of other people. Of course, they didn't want to enable the withdrawals at that time um because then people will be able to draw withdraw money that shouldn't have been able to withdraw um so a lot of a lot of stuff i mean at least this is the story that we're getting guys look that's all i can tell you this is the story that we're getting um so that's what we're happening and now you know that we were waiting on the update for that to be resolved and now we get another message in the telegram just about 6 30 eastern time um, we got a message in the telegram i'm gonna pull it up here we're gonna go through this message together guys on what's going on with vortic united let me try to minimize this over here if it will let me i guess not but um so i want to go over this right let me show you something here dear vortic united partners after long nights and countless hours of internal discussions we are hereby delivering you the long-awaited update regarding the withdrawal system all work has been completed and the handover has been completed however while this work was going on we ran into different issues on another front most have already noticed that the short-term packages once they expire create insane amounts on the balances which is not intended this is getting addressed by the IT at the moment and the approach on how to fix or roll back is worked out. Unfortunately, we also had several trades spiraling out of control. And here is what happened. As you know, numerous of different accounts and sub accounts are incorporated into the trading strategy. We noticed that some high risk accounts were in huge drawdown, which also affected other accounts directly because the accounts were in cross margin mode, which wasn't noticed early enough. The difference between cross and isolated margin is that in case of a drawdown and at the point where the liquidation event would occur, the system just automatically starts to incorporate free capital on other accounts as margin. The overall strategy is and always was profitable. That's why those losses went unnoticed until it was too late. We are currently working on a comprehensive rebalancing and restructuring plan on both the trading and the technical front. You can rest assured that everything is moving in the right direction and already several positive approaches are getting laid out. As you can imagine, such an encompassing endeavor isn't done overnight and it also involves ex external consultants and lawyers. However, we are working day and night and will present the restructuring process on Saturday and start to roll it out next week. Thank you for your strong support and we will update you soon. Stay tuned. All right, guys, that's the message. Now, I don't know what you guys are thinking, I don't know what you guys are taking from that message, but here's one thing that I don't like. I don't like when there's issue after issue after issue. I've seen people say that it's a stalling mechanism. I can see people say this is just a, a slow rug pull. Guys, 
I, it, it doesn't look good to me when there's thing after thing. Yes, we don't have any choice but to wait right now if we're in, right? We don't know. We don't have we have a choice to wait right now. If we're in. We, we can't really do anything, right? But here's what I want to tell you. I'm not waiting around. I'm I'm going to make my money, right? I got I I got to find alternative ways to make money. Hopefully you guys are diversified. Hopefully you guys have seen the new things that I put out to put us in position to be in control of our money and not let these other companies, these other platforms be in control of our money all the time. You need to have some money that you're multiplying on your own because you never know what is going to happen with these platforms. It is literally the wild, wild west out here, right? So I want to tell you guys, yes, I'm going to keep you updated. When they say they're going to release something on Saturday, if I get something, I'm going to put it out just like I did this video, right? And if they come out with a restructuring plan, if it allows us to withdraw some of our capital, if nothing, here's what I advise you. Try to get some of your capital out. Stay on top of this thing. Don't let's let it go to the wayside, right? Try to get some of your capital out if they do open up withdrawals. But otherwise, guys, we got to stay vigilant in this in this market and we got to continue to you know do things to make our own money and i want us to have more money under our own control not under the control of these platforms that's the direction that i am moving am i going to stay in the high risk space there are some platforms that are making me good money in the high risk space so yes i'm going to continue to make money with those but i'm also going to advocate that people get educated on how to multiply money in the markets themselves that's going to be your best bet. Is that saying that you're not going to lose money yourself? You may, but I'd rather be in control of my money than waiting for somebody else to be in control of my money, right? So that's what I'm saying. This is what I'm putting out here, guys. You know I'm going to keep you updated, which is much stuff as I can. As always, you know what our motto is, guys. We're going to invest wisely. We're going to invest well. We will only invest what we're willing to lose, but you know we're investing for the opportunity to win. Until the next video, I hope you guys have an absolutely phenomenal day and I am out. Peace.